Hi, I'm Sophie and welcome to my world. Well, today I've got a webisode of Try It, Don't Buy It for you. Now, in a previous webisode, which is in the link down below, you will see that I unboxed my Victoria Moon's Diamond Painting Kit. Now, today I'm going to tell you all about it. First and foremost, let me show you the product. This is how far I have gotten. This is 80 hours worth of work. Yes, you heard me, 80 hours worth of work. Let me just say this. It's a really neat idea. I think it's a super fun idea. It's, it's, it's kind of a different take on like a puzzle. And what we did with this, my family and I, is I took this up at Christmas time, and usually we do a puzzle as a family, and I took this up instead. And I thought, oh, this will be really fun. We'll do this instead. Okay. My mother, my sister, and I sat around literally for three days, and this is as far as we've got. So it's an accumulation of about 80 hours, and this is as far as we got. Here's the problems with it. These things, these little pieces, these little diamond chips are so incredibly tiny. And you're supposed to put them on, let me show you, with these little, these little teeny tiny stylists like this, right? And you put a little bit of wax on it and you dip it into whatever color that you're doing and then you place it onto this canvas, which is sticky. Now, it's really cool and it's a really great idea, except for the fact that there are literally 35 different colors and they all come in these tiny little itty bitty packets. And there's two sides to them. There's a rounded side and a flat side. And the flat side is what you're supposed to be sticking onto the canvas. The rounded side is what's supposed to face up and that's what gives you that sparkly effect. They flip on you, and it takes forever to like kind of get them to flip over. And then just figuring out what color you're supposed to put on it. And I, I mean, I just have to tell you, I am a crafter and an artist. My mother is an artist. My sister is an artist. We were so exhausted and so sort of frustrated by this. And, and one of the other things that I have to tell you that's really annoying is it doesn't come with a big picture. You know, you always get a big picture when you, when you do like a puzzle. This right here, this teeny tiny little thing, that is your picture that you're supposed to create this entire piece of artwork from. All right. By now you probably have figured out. Try it, don't buy it. From my perspective, and I'm, and I'm so sorry to say this, Victoria's Moon, but I'm going to say, don't buy it. And the reason for it is it's just too tedious. It's just too hard. Now, if you happen to be one of those people that is incredibly patient and has really, really great eyesight and happens to be in a place where there's amazing light and you can work on this and you have hours and hours and hours of time to do so, have at it. But for myself, try it, don't buy it, I'm going to say, eh, don't buy it. Sorry, Victoria's Moon. For more ideas, check us out at sophie-world.com. And if you want more honest opinions about the things that I try as to whether you should try or don't buy, check us out, sophie-world.com. Mm -hmm.